Hi everyone, I'm Heather Chastain and I'm going to walk you through some of our new compensation plan enhancements that you may have heard from some of your leaders coming out of Leadership Forum last week in New Orleans. What a wonderful event it was. We talked through lots of business building opportunities. But the one change that we made that I want to make sure you really understand how to incorporate into your business to, income, to maximize your income are some of the enhancements we've made to the compensation plan. Now as with all compensation plan changes, they won't all apply to you, depending on your level within the organization. Maybe you're a designer who's just doing this part-time and having a little fun, most of the things we're going to be talking about might not apply to you, but they're always good to know what's out there as you choose to grow your business and start to maximize all of the income possibilities that exist here at Celebrating Home. The first one I want to walk you through is a change that we have made to the Rising Star bonus. Now as you know, right now as you promote to the level of Rising Star, if in the month that you promote to Rising Star, you achieve $450 in sales and have a working designer on your team, then you can earn a $100 bonus. The problem is sometimes you don't know you're going to promote to Rising Star until really close to the end of the month and it takes a little effort to make sure you've got all those boxes checked. So we're keeping that $100 bonus in place, which is a phenomenal bonus for promoting to that level, but we're giving you an additional month to earn that bonus. So all the same criteria apply. You still need to promote to Rising Star, you still need to have $450 in sales, and you still need to have that, that ever important working designer, which as you know is someone with just $300 PV in the month, but you don't have to have that in the same month you promote anymore. You have another full month in order to achieve that bonus. We're also going to support you uh, by sending a message to those newly promoted rising stars to make sure that they know exactly what they need to do and uh, if you're one of those as I'm sure we're going to have thousands of newly promoted rising stars here in the next few months with the great recruiting jackpot promotion that's going on right now we'll make sure you know everything you need to do to get that hundred dollars in your hand because that's a very nice bonus just for doing things that grow and support your business and help other people along the way. That's the first change is an enhancement to the rising star bonus. The next one that we're uh, going to talk through uh, is the designer commission rebate. All of the enhancements that we're making here today that I'm going to be sharing with you on this uh, webinar are all about increasing your paycheck. Whether you're an executive, uh, whether you're looking to increase your PUV and increase the, the dollars that are coming from your unit, or whether you're a designer who's looking to put more dollars in your pocket, all of the changes uh, that we are presenting are all designed to increase your income, which is what we're all about here at Celebrating Home. So we made some enhancements to the designer commission rebate. As you know right now, if you achieve $1,000 PV in any given month, you receive an additional 5% rebate for a total of 35% personal commission, which would be about $350. If you achieve $1,500 in PV, you get 40% or an additional 10% rebate. And if you achieve $2,000, you get 45% or a 15% bonus. We are not making any changes to the 35, 40, or 45%, meaning 5, 10, or 15% additional rebate on top of the industry leading 30% that you start out with. You still get the 5%, you still get the 10%, you still get the 15%. But from March 1st going forward, we're going to ask you to to have $1,250 in PV for that first level, $1,750 in PV for the second level, and $2,250 in PV for that third level. So you still get the 5%, 10%, and 15%, and you just have to do, really, on average, it's less than about half a party more each month in order to achieve those bonuses. What that does for you when you reach to, when you, when you work to reach that goal, that puts about 25% more income in your pocket. As you can see from the slide, at the 35% level, you would have received $350 in commission by reaching that first level. And now when you reach the first level, you will receive $438 in commission, which is about a 25% increase in dollars into your pocket. Now, if you're a rising star, senior rising star, executive or above, you really want to be thinking through your unit commissions and really looking and saying, how much volume am I generating and how much am I earning on the volume of my team? Now, if you're not at that level yet and you're listening to this, what that's about is as you grow in this business and as you move up in the career plan, you have more and more opportunities to earn money. You don't just earn money on your personal sales, but you start to earn money on the sales of the people on your team. So if you're on that rising star level, senior rising star really want to be focusing a good part of your energy understanding those pieces within the compensation plan and knowing how the things that the company does can help you increase your unit volume increasing your paycheck and at the same time because it's a win-win for everyone increasing the income of the people that are on your team because just like we're here to help increase your income as leaders you're there to help increase the income of the designers on your team
So if you want to take a look at the next slide here, this is a, a picture of an executive and how they earn overrides on those commissions. So uh, a, a very, very conservative example, say you just have three designers on your team at that $1,000 level. That's $3,000 uh, of personal volume coming from those three designers. And again, they're just at that very first level. Uh, you earn 4% on those, assuming they're your personally sponsored. You earn additional 4% uh, on them because you're personally sponsored, so you're earning 8% percent on the those that three thousand dollars in sales so you're earning two hundred and forty dollars on those sales now if you're below that rising star level and you're thinking about joining and thinking about moving up in the career plan and thinking about taking advantage of the current recruiting promotion to help you do that you really want to pay attention to these numbers because this is dollars in your pocket on top of the money that you're already making from your personal sales that can really help drive your career here at celebrating home and add extra dollars into your family uh, budgets and we all know uh, there's not a family budget out there that wouldn't like an extra $240 uh, in your pockets every single month for whatever it is your needs are. Now as you can see with the enhancements that we've made to the plan with the new levels at $1,250 you've uh, increased that to $300. So you added $60 more dollars uh, which is what? I mean that's an electric bill, right? I mean that's a water bill. That's something. That's a bill that you can pay now for no additional work on your part as a leader you know your designer is excited because she's already added an additional 25% income into her pocket by doing that work. Plus, really important, you have added $750 into your PV levels that go towards qualification for uh, achieving commission overrides at each of those levels. So uh, your designer has added an increase in income because she's received additional money on additional volume. You've received an increase in income because you have more volume in, uh, in your unit and you've added more dollars to your PV for work for qualifying totals. And of course, as you're doing anything uh, in the future that might relate to contest points for trips or promotions or all anything else PV is PV is PV so it all starts to add up and we double on top of itself as we look to, to the future of these kinds of promotions. So that's an exciting change that we have made in those uh, personal commission rebate bands by shifting them just a little bit, going to increase your income, increase the income of the designers uh, on your teams, all for what, less than half an additional party per month for those who are really working and achieving at those levels in the business on a consistent basis. The next uh, uh, element that we want to talk through is about qualifications to become an executive. And again, this is a, we have a, a broad audience listening to this tape, so this may not apply to some of you, but even if you're a brand new designer who is uh, reading this because it came in my blog and you're saying, my goodness, I, I must need to hear, hear this, it might be just a little soon to be hearing about this level of detail on promoting to an executive. What I want you to know about promoting to an executive, if you're a brand new designer or someone relatively new to the business, is that within Celebrating Home, the sky's the limit in terms of earning opportunity. You can do whatever it is that you want and achieve achieve whatever it is that you want from this business and the career path is the way to make that happen for you. The enhancements we've made to promoting to an executive are all designed to streamline that for you to make that easier than ever to promote to the level of executive. And so what we've done is we've kept the PV requirement the same. You still need to have $600 PV uh, to promote to an executive. We have increased the dollar amount of PUV required to promote slightly to $7,000 from $6,000. It was $6,000. We, we increased that to $7,000. And we are asking that you do $7,000 PUV in three out of five months. What that's going to do is give you a very strong, stable base for business. Now, the $6,000, the $7,000, all these levels that you hear us talking about at the executive level in terms of minimum required to get paid as. We talked a lot about this at Leadership Forum. That's a, this is all about minimum level required. We really want you to maximize your income, not reach the bare minimum. So we really want everyone thinking about uh, viewing their executive business in terms of 10000 12000 15000 19000 What would your income be when you get to those levels? We're not changing the requirement to get paid as an executive from anything other than 6000 uh, there was some little rumor going around on Facebook over the weekend. Uh, we're not changing that at all. It's still 6000 in order to get paid. We're asking that that executive uh, have 7000 to promote because we want to make sure she is nice and strong and stable. And at least 3000 of that, I'm sorry, the, at the most 3000 of that can come from the executive herself. So at least 4000 is coming from the people on her team. But we are eliminating the requirement to have a senior rising star uh, designer. 
Now, don't take that to mean that we don't think it's important that you have a senior rising star on your team. I, I personally really do think it is important when you're promoting to that level of executive that you start to not only develop your skills as a leader, but start to have leaders on your team that you're teaching to develop those leadership skills. That's an important part of the evolution of owning your own business and becoming a business leader. But we're not having that be a requirement to promote in order to simplify that process. So uh, starting, I think it's March or April. In fact, I think it's officially it's April 1st uh, to promote to executive. Uh, you have to have $600 PV, a minimum of 7,000 PUV, of which 3,000, only 3,000 can come from you as an executive, and you have to do that three out of five months. Now, if you're a senior rising star and you've been working towards promoting to executive under the original or the previous requirements, do not fear. Do not feel like we're changing that on you. You just reach out to us, send us an email, uh, email Linda Allen or, or myself. My email is real simple. It's just heather at celebratinghome.com and I'll get your email to the right place and let us know that you're working towards it under the existing criteria and we're happy to support you and help you promote uh, in a way that works best for you. But most people are going to find that this is a streamlining of this promoting to executive process that's going to work really well and really smoothly for them and make that a, an easier, more comfortable hurdle and at the end of the day have a much stronger and more stable business at the end of it. So that's the um that's the benefit for you. Uh, as you're stabilizing and strengthening your team as you promote to executive, that means for you senior executives and above, as you have these new leaders that are emerging, that means higher PUV for you going forward, uh, a higher confidence level in the success of that new executive promoting. Because again, all that we're focused on, all that we're really about here is, is focusing on stabilizing your income, increasing the possibilities for you, and making it a simpler process than ever to move up within the career path at Celebrating Home. So that's that's really the, the crux of the changes. We are uh, in giving you more opportunities to earn the rising star bonus as you promote up in the career plan. We have uh, shifted the designer commission rebates slightly uh, to the right, slightly up a little bit to increase your personal commission as well as increase uh, your PUV and the commission you receive as executives and higher uh, for, for just, a, again, not even not even a whole party uh, in difference as you're at that, that 1200 1500, 1750, and 2250 levels. Uh, we have streamlined the qualifications to be an executive and uh, one additional uh, enhancement, and this really applies to executives and above, as a perk of being an executive, another reason to think about moving up in the career plan. In March, we will be doing a one-time sponsoring line roll-up. We will be doing roll-ups in your sponsoring downline, one time only in March, uh, uh, to true up those levels. And the best way to think about it is if you are an executive or higher, and you have someone on your in your downline where there's a gap between you and that person, meaning their, their sponsor won the lottery and moved to Florida for whatever reason, as of April 1st, they will then be considered your personal sponsor or your level one within your unit. And that applies only to executives and above, so executive, senior executive, etc., up the career path. It's a one-time uh, uh, only in March. That doesn't mean it's only effective in March. That was one little uh, miscommunication that was floating out there. We're just going to do that in March, but that change then is permanent for the duration of the plan. And you'll start to see that all shake out on the reports during the month of March, uh, so that by the, by the time March comes to a close and your April commission checks or your March commission checks are processed in April, all those changes will have been made. And, and that's it. We, we, uh, we really put all of our energy into making sure that these enhancements were focused on increasing your income, streamlining this business, making it easier than ever to do business with Celebrating Home. And when you couple that with all the promotions that we have going on to celebrate our third anniversary here in March, uh, I guarantee you anyone who was achieving the $1,000 level sales level before is going to have no problem achieving $1,250 PV in the months of March with all the exciting and fabulous specials and promotions that we have going on and that we plan on continuing uh, do, for you as you build your business going forward.